guys, this is me love over here, and today we're going to teach you about the parts common to all plants. And it's already September now. It's on, it's near Christmas, December, and it's also near my birthday, November twenty-five. <coughs> so we're just going to discuss here. See? First, look at the plants below. As you can see, these are the see, see, these are the plants, and you can see this one is just the flowers. The flowers are in here. See on the top here, the stem. As you could probably know, it's these in here. These two plants are not the same, but they have, and they have, they have all the same parts. They have the leaves. They have the flowers. And they have the roots and stem, the roots of the roots and stem. But not any plants that have the same. Some plants can have roots, some plants can have red leaves, of course. And as you can see here, this um, it is the one that pulls the leaves and the flowers. If there's no stem, there's no there's no leaves or flowers could hang on. Now here is the roots. Roots one is the it's the one that connected the stem. The roots hold the stem. If there wasn't any root, the stem would fall off. So there is no honey. So this one, go over here. Roots hold the plant in the soil. Plants are able to stand upright. See. See, this is the roots, it's, it's under the soil, it has like cooking things here. Plants are able to stand upright because of their roots, the soil gives water and mineral. Because the the soil and drinks up the water and goes up the stand and, you know, feeds it. Okay, you may go water to the next, you may go to the next part. No, no, I mean next part of oh, the yes. plant. Stems connect the roots to the leaves of the plant. See, see, if there wasn't any stem, we would have, see? You can see this, see this little line there? It's connecting the leaves and the stem. The next one, and we're going to go to the leaves. Leaves have the important job of making food for the plants. They make food with the help of water and air and sunlight. That's it. And then, this one, flowers makes, make plants more beautiful, they are of different colors. See, this is the rose, and everyone is the same. See, different colors, you see, I call that this cool. Where is that one? <laughs> oh, plants grow. Plants grow everywhere. They grow in different places in your own backyard in deserts as you can see in the pictures here this one's like water is here and it's lily pads it's the water this is the plants that live in the water and this are the aerial plants they live in the air the, the, the plants that live in the air is called the aerial not just air plants and then in creations and in other places most plants grow in land for example trees leaves and cactuses in the desert those are the plants that are in the desert there's also be dead bushes and then also of course the grass can also live in the land and then the trees of course the plants so the water is fine the lily pads and the water leaves live on the water and that's also some seaweeds and some water leaves. Teacher, I have a question. What, what about water balloon? Does it also... No, the water the balloon, no, it will just float ahead. Really? No, it just floats It doesn't ahead. stay on the water? No, it just floats ahead. Oh, I because see. Because the water balloon is light. It needs to be a heavier balloon to sink. 
Oh. Can we do an experiment on that so we can? But sorry, but we don't have enough for this. All right. A few plants grow in air. These are called aerial plants. The aerial plants is, for example, like an orchid. <laughs> what orchid? Isn't it orchid? Yeah. And then it's just my version of saying. <laughs> Plants grow and live on the branches of the trunk of the trees. This could be hanging in the pot in the air that's attached to them. Sometimes you see that in uh, some magnificent houses. Magnificent houses? Can we see that plant in here in our house? We saw it, but you don't have to have that because that's too expensive in the plus. <laughs> what can you see? What kind of? Quiet student. Plants also breathe, they breathe by absorbing carbon oxide. No oxide! Carbon? Teacher, I think you're wrong. F. Carbon? Dioxide. Dioxide. From the air and giving out oxygen. Like other living things, plants also move in different ways. Mm. These are the plants that can climb, which is Upa. Ube, calabaza, also calabaza, you know, we, you can also call it squash or pumpkin. Mm -hmm. And palaya can also climb because it sticks to the branches. And sitao, what is this? This is more things. Sitao, string beans. Sayote, sidis, sidis. Sayote, that's the one we put in tinolang manok. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The soup with some, chicken. Some plants like Upo, Ube, and Palacito, Kamabasa, Sayote, Patola, and Batao Klein. Ra uh, teacher, like, I have a question. What about the lizard that I see climbing up? Are they also... Can you consider it also a climbing plant? Sorry, but the lizard is not a plant. It's an animal. Oh, I see. I'm sorry. Like gabby and sweet potato, they crawl. Oh, how about the, ba the baby that crawls? No, it only crawls in the food. No, it's it's not a bird. A baby is a human being. Oh. The everyone knows that baby doesn't crawl. <laughs> crawl. <laughs> the... But when you were a baby, you also crawl, teacher. Actually, I do not crawl all the way to the bed. Yes, you do. You, just, you did. You just, you just scared me in the bed. <laughs> okay. the, so I think the that's race. all. The my uh, here plants, here plants has leaves that close when they touch. Again, see this. This the flower. For example, if you touch my hand, the flowers will bloom. Touch my hand. The if flower it, will, or the makahiya plant will. Okay, for example. Touch it. Ching. Like it's that? Like a, yeah. Ah. But if no one touches it, it will bloom again and open. Okay. Have you seen that one in real life? He, um, no, but teachers, uh, but my teacher in school probably showed up in her cell phone. Of course, all teachers have so much. So okay. Bye. So, so bye guys. Thank you for watching. Thank you, teacher. Please. We've learned a lot. Please subscribe and like the video. Bye. What? Bye. Invite them to like and subscribe your channel. Oh, you invite them now. Yeah, bye. And also, leave us tap the bell for notification, guys. And comment down below if you see what you want more videos, guys. Please like and subscribe. Bye.